Hi, I'm Miranda Seuss, a wedding photographer and engagement photographer here in New Jersey. And I wanna share some tips with you when you're planning an engagement shoot with your dog or dogs. So there are five things I need to go over with you guys so you're really prepared for the best session that feels stress-free and still getting really good photos with your fur baby. All right, so let's talk about the five things. First things first is training. So before you plan a photo shoot, especially engagement photos with your furry friend, your pet, your dog, you wanna make sure they know a few commands for you know, preparing for their close up and being a model for the photo session. There are three commands that I would recommend that your dog would know, which is sit, stay, and no jumping, okay? Because most of the times we don't want any dirty paws all over your beautiful, very probably expensive engagement shoot outfits. So learning that command is really important for your dog before the photo shoot. Another one is sit and stay. Obviously, the better they are at this, at that command, then definitely reward them with a treat. So be prepared to bring treats with you for the session and giving your dog more treats than normal just for this photo shoot. Next thing, after you get your training done with your dog for the photo shoot, you're gonna want to plan to exercise your pet before the photo shoot. What I mean by this is play with your dog, play catch, have them run around a bunch, uh, I would say show up to the photo shoot location about two hours before if you can or even an hour before your session so you can really tire out your pet. If you can't go to the photo shoot location that early, maybe do it at home before the car ride to really tire out your pet before the session. Play with them, like I said, and have them run around, get that energy out. That way they're a little bit more on that chill level when they arrive to the session. Third thing is Let's think of accessories. Now, your modeling dog, your fur baby, will want to look really good for their close-up. So, some things I would recommend is shopping brand new collar and leash. If you prefer a harness, get a harness for your dog. Now, I mean, get something really beautiful just for the photo shoot. I know they're not always like the best to walk your dog in, um, but do do your research on it, but I would recommend something neutral, maybe a light color like a white, a tan. Now, if you're doing more of a colorful theme, definitely stick with that color palette that you're looking for and having your dog represent that same color uh, in their leash and collar. Try and accessorize your dog with a really cute bandana announcing your engagement or your wedding. You can have them wear an outfit. Sometimes if your dogs are really easy going, they can wear a sign around their neck. Uh, so that would be a fun idea as well. Just make sure they know that sit and stay command because you don't want them running around with a sign around their neck, especially if it's made out of wood or metal or chalkboard or whatever. All right, and there's two more things you need to know before having your photo shoot with your dog. And that is supervision. So I don't like having photo sessions with pets if there isn't somebody to supervise your dog during the session because the last thing I want is you stressing out during your photo shoot and it makes it no fun when you have to watch your dog at the same exact time or you're worried they're getting into things you know no one's watching them things like that I don't want that happening during a session. During your session, it's supposed to be fun, it's supposed to be romantic, it's supposed to be focusing on the two of you, connecting, not your dog the entire time. And that gets me into the fifth thing that you should know about your photo shoot with your dog. The fifth thing is how long is the photo shoot with your dog? The fact is, I like to run my photo shoots really efficiently and usually the first things I like to do is take those photos with your dogs your dog first or dogs first so that'll take about five to ten minutes of the session and the rest of the session is just the, the two of you and now those first five to ten minutes we'll get those shots with your dog we'll get plenty of different posing and fun things you could do with your pet 
and I would recommend probably a more casual outfit for that just in case your dog does tend to jump on accident you know they are an animal so they'll do what they want to do at the moment when they're excited um, they'll have their close-up they're ready because you've trained them you've exercised them you got them all dolled up and you have somebody to watch them for five to ten minutes of fame and that's it thank you so much for watching i hope this gives you a lot of insight and feel really prepared for your engagement photos with your pet dog and for baby. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye guys.